Good morning, happy Friday. We're going to go through today for Friday Chit Chat. We are going to use the um, makeup that is in the um, Shop My Stash for April. Except for the um, primer, it's gonna be the Becca Skin Love because I don't have a primer in here, so I must have finished the primer that was in here. I believe it was the Maybelline one. How is everyone doing? Is anyone else's state opening a little bit? We, um, our restaurants or movie theaters and other places are allowed to open. Um, at 25% capacity. Um, bars and things like that. Um, salons. Um, workout centers, they're not allowed to open yet. So, I don't know. But we're getting towards something, I guess. Some people are able to go back to work. I guess that's how it works out. But we're going to see, because this is the... Some of the stuff may end up back in here, but some of the stuff is probably going to come out. Like the Too Faced thing um, palette will probably come out. Um... Some of the other stuff, I don't know. I'm going to put a couple of drops of this Laura Gallagher Dew Dreamer and Gilded Honey on the palette and mix it with the, um, I think it's gonna be the Clinique Even Better Foundation in the shade Meringue or WN12. And I gotta, I, I've been getting to think that's done too. Mm -hmm. So, let's see, let's grab a thing that I could use. I don't know where my little spatula went. So, let's go ahead and. Right, I'm not going to. Um, use this um, thing here. All right. Let's go ahead and, I've been liking this thing. I need to go ahead and clean it and do a side-by-side -side with the Tati Beauty one. But I'm gonna use this. We're going to put our foundation on. So let's see, this week we woke up, we had a bad storm the other night and um, it wasn't yesterday morning, it was the morning before. It came through at about five, I think. And we lost electricity and we got electricity about nine o'clock in the morning. But Eric woke up without electricity and it ruined his entire day. It was Wednesday morning. Once he woke up and his, he couldn't do his thing he does first thing in the morning, that was all she wrote. She, um, he, um, couldn't do nothing. He was literally just a pain all day. He was cranky and everything else. One thing out of whack in his whole day is just ruined which I can't say that hasn't happened for normal people as well. Because let's face it, sometimes people get cranky when their day, one little thing happens and they ruin the rest of their own day. They're like, oh, the day's ruined. And they bring that into fruition. The mind is a powerful thing. But um, let's see what else. I did do an order from Sephora. I mean, it's not a very big one. I think it was like $100. Because let's face it, it's not the time to be doing big $500 orders like some other people are doing. Plus, I've thought about it, and when I spend $500, which I've never done, 
<laughs> at Sephora, I'm not gonna get as much as if I spent $500 at Ulta. You get less. Uh, Eric. What are you doing, baby? <clears throat> Mommy needs us down. We have company. You want to say hi? No. Okay. So we got the foundation on. I got a breakout right there. I think it's hormones. Let's see what else did I do this week. I got a fancy little step watch. I got this on Amazon for $29. It came in to yesterday. And so far it did record my sleep, which it didn't tell me nothing I didn't already know. That I barely sleep type thing. I'm just trying to pat this foundation down better. Now we're going to use this Maybelline. I cannot remember the name of this. So this is the concealer we're going to use. Um, I don't really want to. Right there on that pimple, I'm going to take some of this foundation that's still on this pad and blend that in so it's not like a bright spot. It's just kind of a... I really don't like the way... Okay, we're going to use this. I'm going to pat that down first. All right, and we're going to do the center. But, um, I also made an order from um, Private Society. They have this um, $100 Glow Getter mystery box right now. Um, the links will be in the description to go to their website. Um, I, I'm going to put that video up tomorrow because I think Monday I want to do the full face because I literally got a full face of makeup in that box. Which was pretty cool. So I want to use, put the unboxing video up so that... We could do that full face of private society, which I mean, I didn't get a whole full face. I got a couple of things that like, I think it's blush, maybe concealer, and maybe a bronzer that I need to pull from somewhere else. And let's go ahead and use this L'Oreal True Match Blendable Powder um, under the eyes just to set them. got that um I think this is almost done yeah this is the Anastasia mink that was in there this is the sample size Let's put a little there there That one didn't want to do what I wanted it to do. Turn this down a little bit. Eric's not in here no more. Mm. 
I'm just blending it with my finger on the sides there. All right, now we're gonna take this. This is like an e.l.f. contouring, yeah, contouring brush. I've had this for a while. Pull it up into the hairline like that. Um, yeah, but what other states are opening up a little bit and how are they doing it? Like, how is your state doing it? If they're opening back up. Is it at 25% capacity? If our governor keeps reminding us that if the hospitals start to get overrun with new cases or the cases skyrocket or not skyrocket, go back up, they're shutting it down again. So what's your state doing? This is probably the craziest thing that's ever happened in my lifetime. And um, probably the craziest thing that will stay happening in my lifetime. I doubt we'll really go through another pandemic. And I'm well aware this one's not over. I think people think because things are opening up that it's over. But until people are immune or there is a um, vaccine, we are looking at no normal life for a while. That's the crazy thing. Things are going to have to be... And what's flu season going to be like? Are we all going to be back at the house? <laughs> During flu season, when it starts to get cold and everything else, I don't know. There we go. Actually, it looks really good. It's nice, nice and soft. We're going to take um, this um, best year ever. And we're going to use the bronzer and the blush. So we're going to take this brush first. just kind of build it up it's like a big spot on my forehead This is the Chocolate Soleil bronzer, which I love that bronzer. I'm gonna take this regular brush that's got a little bit of powder still on it. I'm going to take this one again and deepen that side up a little bit to match this side. <sighs> the ones that we're going to graduate this year, what are you, is your family going to do something for you? Did the city like do a little something? Um, how is that working? Because I was trying to figure out exactly what's going on because I haven't seen anything because I don't think any of my friends have someone graduating. So I don't know how that's happening and I really hope that something's happening for y'all because that's a lot of work. And I don't know, I just feel so bad for y'all. It's a lot of work for no 
it recognition, I'm sure, is what it feels like. But we see you. You did good. You went 12 years of school and you're done. We're going to use this Makeup Revolution Golden Highlighter. I could have used the one that was already in there. I just keep thinking about all of you. And I think that I don't think this has got enough in it, but we'll check. This is the NYX. Dewy setting spray. So I don't know if because states are starting to open up, if they're going to like try to do a little graduation ceremony. for people or not. I like the way this base makeup looks. All right. Let me know. Let me know if your families are doing something for you, like some, like a little tiny party, even if it's, or if the city that you live in, if they're like getting together a parade of all the graduates to sit in a car separate from other people and go down the road and like the birthday parades people talk about that people are doing where everybody can you just go down every road in your city and people could stand out there and congratulate you or you know what I mean like is any cities doing anything like that that would be awesome I know Mother's Day is coming up. Usually that's prom for the school district here. There's no prom, but I just, I'm gonna use the Anastasia, that was the Anastasia Brow Wiz, and this is the Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. I kind of feel like putting eyeshadow on is gonna mess this up, but you know, we could always take this and do a natural eyeshadow look. Because there is some very natural colors in here. So that's what I'll try. Let's go with um, Deck the Malls. It's like a mauve light purple. We're dust dusting that across the eye. Now we're gonna take the crease brush. We're gonna go into faux fur only. It's like a light brown. And we're gonna stick that in the crease. to get them to match. I feel like I'm dunking. I don't know what's going on. The, the um, Eric knocked the thing over and I feel like I haven't got it back to where it usually was. Look at that. So I feel like the camera angle is not very good right now. All right, now we're gonna take um, 
Halo. I think that's like the perfect light shade. Yeah, we're gonna take Halo on a flat brush. She'll call back, or I'll call her back in a minute. We got this, we're gonna go in with Halo. Told you she called back. I'll call her. I have to go somewhere in a little while, so. If y'all are praying people, um, I know I have people all over the world, so whoever, whatever your religious preference is, I have learned some information about my family one of my aunts, per se, um, prayers. I don't want to go into it because it is family drama, but y'all are like my friends. No, y'all are my friends. Let's be honest. I'm just trying to blend this a little bit to look different. <coughs> and, um, I wouldn't tell my friends about this either on the, like, outright what it is. Like, the ones I see in person. But, um, yeah, silent prayers. Going through some stuff. Help her see her way out through the other side. And we're going to take the faux fur color underneath the eye. Um, wow. Tomorrow's video, Monday's video, we'll have the winner of the monthly giveaway. I did not forget, and I will try to put together the new one. It'll either go up later today, or it'll go up Monday. I cannot believe everything's been so crazy. But there is another giveaway and there is a winner. I promise. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead. Put a little bit of mascara on. We're gonna use this little tiny MAC one because I'm pretty sure this is done for. If I could pull a winner out of my head right now, I would. But I'm being honest, I totally forgot and haven't ran the comment generator. All right. Let's put a little bit of lip gloss on. Something about this look tells me lip gloss is all I need, but out of this box, we have the Revolution and Worth It. There we go. And let's take a little bit more of the NYX Dewy Setting Spray. Pat it down and call it done. I'll see y'all in the next one. Um, have a great weekend and I guess you'll see me either later on today or tomorrow. So, see you later.